Hey everybody, Mental Fox here. Welcome back to Kingdom Come Deliverance. We still have the stink of jail on us. You see that icon down there? Uh, if we look at the player screen and buffs, uh, released prisoner. It says your stay in jail has left you malnourished and in an overall weak condition. Your strength, agility, and vitality are lowered. The longer you've been in jail, the worse the penalty. So it doesn't seem to do anything to our charisma, which is surprising to me, but it does lower our speech. Um, and that's important because I was thinking that since we're here in uh, Sassal, maybe we could go and try to sweet talk the custodian and get some supplies from him. But if I've got a speech penalty, it's probably not a good time for that to happen. Um, optionally, we could bring some game meat to the infirmary. Um, maybe I could just hop on our horse here and um, see if we can't just go and shoot some rabbits or something. Let me look at the map, see what the map looks like. If I were to just go north, oh, there's the custodian. I don't even know if I could, okay, it looks like if I go here, well, that would take me down to the water. Uh, if I go out here and go out this way, then maybe I could go up here to these uh, woods. Whoa! Oh! Sorry. <laughs> um, whoa, whoa, whoa. Sorry. Uh, horse? <laughs> this horse is not going the way I want it to go. Um, yeah, let's just ride off into the uh, woods over here. This way, horse. Come on. And uh, we'll see if we can find some game to shoot. Maybe we can get us some game and um, bring it back. And maybe that'll make Yohanka like us again. I don't know. I don't think I've been in these woods yet. There's actually a marker or something over here. There's a, a cross here. Let's uh, pay our respects. Conciliation cross. Um, this one says Christian Smith. Oh, there's somebody walking over there, but... I don't know whether that's a bad guy or not. I don't think it is, because he's wearing red. But what do I know? I really don't want to fight anybody. But I will tell you one thing. I don't want anybody to see me doing this either. You know? Because it's technically illegal for us to do what I'm getting ready to do. And it would be really bad if we were caught. But uh, first, I need to find something to shoot. Get my bow out. Uh, for archery, you need arrows. Where did my arrows go? Why don't I have any arrows equipped? How did that happen? I don't know. Ordinary arrows. Oh. I only have one ordinary arrow, that's all? Wow. I only have two hunting arrows. What the heck, man? Man, I am... I am low on arrows, apparently. There's a bunny. Oh, he moved away. Oh, man. I felt like that was pretty close, actually. <laughs> um, I got a bunch of these long-distance arrows, even though this isn't a long distance. Damn it. Got one. I feel quite hungry. Yeah, you'll deal with it. Loot. 22 hair meat. A hair pelt and my arrow, we get that back. So I got 22 meats. So at this rate, it shouldn't take us too long. Don't know where that other bunny went. Where'd you go, bunny? Where'd you go? Lost track of you. That's okay, there'll be more of them frolicking about, I'm sure. See if we could find something else. Something else for us to shoot. Down here by the water, maybe. There's um some critter there. My stomach growling is gonna scare him away. Ah. 
Nope. Damn it, quit moving. Well, I don't know if I hit it or not. If I could hit this thing, that'd be a lot of meat. Ah, shoot. Look at that. I got really tired. <laughs> got lightheaded. I am shooting a ton of arrows at this thing. Oh, got it. I hit it. a new level in bow. Get myself a bunch of meat. That is a lot of meat. We have plenty of meat now. Now I need to call Magic Horse. Come here, Magic Horse. Let me put my bow away. So I'm, I can't mount up when I overload it. So let me see what I can put in the horse's saddlebag. The problem is I think that the horse is also pretty much, um, of course can't carry it. Oh, geez. The horse could carry some. I, I wish it would just move as many as it could, you know? It's, it's showing up as stolen meat. <laughs> um, still way over encumbered. I really hate to drop some of this stuff, but I'm going to, um, Let's see, what's the heaviest stuff I've got? The spiked club, I don't know if I'll ever use this. I have a bunch of shoes. I'm gonna drop these shoes. And we'll drop these plate things. And um, more boots, I don't need, I don't need two pairs of boots. Uh, I don't need all these different hoes. I have, uh, Hunter's gloves, a couple pairs of those. And uh, this cabbage is gonna go bad, we'll drop that. Same with this horse meat. Uh, okay, now let's see how much stuff I could move over to the horse. I can't move those. So, I kinda have to play it by ear here. Not even play it by ear, just kinda like guess. Okay, we moved that much over. Uh, horse can still carry more. So we're going to move more of this to the horse. Okay, we're good. Horse is still good. Can carry a little bit more. Move a little bit more to the horse. Okay, good. We're still over encumbered though, but we're getting closer. Horse could carry a little bit more. Okay. I know, I wish there was a better way to do this. All right. I mean, I'm sure there is a better way to do this. I could do math, <laughs> you know, instead of just guessing. Okay, that's as much as I could move over. Um, so that leaves me, leaves me with 17. I really don't need 17. Uh, so I could drop a few of these. Let's drop, um, let's see if they're 0.6 each and I need to drop about one pound. I'm saying pounds. I don't know what the unit of measurement actually is. Okay. Wait a minute. No, it says, okay, whatever. I know I have more meat than that. So now we're going to go back to the infirmary, bring some meat over to them, some stolen meat. I'm sure they're hungry enough that they don't care it's, if it's stolen or not. But that didn't take much time at all for us to do. And I think we're okay. I don't think they're going to care that it's stolen meat. I mean, somebody going to look at the meat and say, Don't eat that, it's stolen. But we'll see. 
I mean, why else would I sh would it show up as stolen? Okay, let's not run over this guy. Hello, law-abiding citizen here. Okay, got a ton of meat. I'm gonna feed myself here real quick. Oh, I can't. Hmm. Um, I could drop. Huh. Why is this not showing meat? Why can't I drop meat in there? I have a bunch of meat. What the hell? So I have this meat. Bring the game meat to the infirmary. So let me get the meat from the horse. Let me get the rest of the meat. No, no, I don't want to mount. I want to uh, bring out my inventory. Horse. Um, hair meat. We'll give them a variety. Deer venison. Okay, that's a lot of meat. We'll just slowly walk over here. I don't know why. Cook item. Cook item. Hair meat. Whoa, I didn't want to cook 22 hair meats. I thought it was going to ask me. All right, fine. I have 22 cooked hair meat. Great. Um, I'll go ahead and eat one of those. This is cooked hair meat. Eat. Okay, I ate one. So I'm not sure how this is going to go here. I'm not sure who I'm supposed to talk to about bringing some meat, some food back. Let's try Yohanka. You see all this meat I'm lugging? Does it say, does it acknowledge that I have 100 meat? It does. Okay, good. Yohanka, I got something for you. Um, I brought some meat. I brought some meat. Red deer venison. Deliver. Ex yeah, well, she only wants 100. Okay, we delivered it. Good. Confirm delivery. Thank you, Henry. Nice. Rich food will definitely help. Okay, good. She uh, seemed pleased with that. God bless. Okay, well, not as pleased as I would have liked. But uh, she seemed pleased. Still a bit over encumbered. Let's go ahead and eat a little bit more of that hair meat that we've cooked up. That gets us up to 74, 88. Each one of these gives us a nourishment of 14. So if I ate another one, I'd get fat. So we don't need to eat another one of those. Um, okay, so we did that. And um, we could try to... We still have help with healing the sick in the monastery. Um, yeah, I mean, I guess I could try to find something to help the insomniac fall asleep. Uh, what I wish is that there was a way that I could get to my stash from here. Um, because if I could get to my stash, I could see what herbs I have stashed. Because I know I have some stashed. Okay. Um, but I think that the only way that I could get to my stash is by, through lodging. Um, so I guess I need to go to where there's lodging, rent a room, and um, then I could get to my stash. So let's go ahead and do that, I guess. I don't really know how else to get to a stash. If you know a way to get to my stash without renting a room, let me know. Um, there's, there might be a way, but I just don't know what it is or... I'm not remembering what it is. I don't think this is the way I wanted to go. You know, I didn't think about this until just now, but when we were back in Ratai, I purposely didn't speak with, um... Teresa, because I, did, I wasn't going to ask her out, but I guess I could have passed along Matthew and Fritz's regards, because that's something that I'm supposed to do. These two guys right here. Oh, this is the lodging. Did not make that turn well at all. Okay. Hop off. Let's see here. Where's the innkeeper? 
empty in here. Where is he? Is he upstairs? Where is this guy? Um, what I'm looking at is the uh, marker on my map. I guess this is him here. My compass, I mean. Yeah, this is him. Good day to you. Good day to you. Um, I need a place to sleep. Not really, but... Can I sleep here? Certainly. For how long? Oh, uh, just, just one night. Just the one night? No problem. But you pay in advance. Okay. Here you are. You'll like it here. Like sleeping on a cloud it is. I'm assuming my bed is in the same place it always is. I hope so, because that's where I'm going. Now, I'm going to look in my stash here. Problem is, I don't remember exactly what I needed to make um, the lullaby potion. Herb Paris, I remember that. Oh, crap. <laughs> it did take all thinking I was going to take all the herb Paris, but instead I took everything out of my... <sighs> Alright. Okay, I don't need all this stuff. Wow, look, look how many... Oh, that's how much damage it does. Um, let's see here. I don't need a boar hide on me right now, so... Let me move this back. Uh, let's see here. This chalice I don't need on me. The ear I don't need on me right now. Oh, I can't move it. Okay. I didn't want to move it anyway. This thing. Um, eye bright I don't need. So these don't look like they spoil, which is nice. When I, these things that I pick. Um, don't really think I need five marigold decoctions on me, so I'll just keep one. So I need Poppy. I know that. I wish I remembered um, what was the other thing that I need. Wow, I only have one Savior Schnapps, is that right? Oh, hey look, a spade! How about that? Hmm, maybe I'll keep that with me. One of these maps I don't need anymore. I think it was map 20. Uh, hang on to those for now. Um, hmm, boy, that's a lot of weight I'm carrying around. Dog on it. Um, well, so I remember that I need some poppy, and I remember that I need some herb Paris, but I don't remember the other ingredient, unfortunately. I guess it wouldn't hurt if I just. Um, grabbed everything. I don't think it was chamomile, but I'm going to grab it anyway. I don't think it was cobwebs or even comfrey, but let's just grab all the um, this stuff so that way I don't have to come back here. Okay, so that's all the crap I've got. So now I'm going to run back up there to the um, Frickin' alchemy bench. And we'll see. Man, I wish I remembered what the other thing was. Whoa, what? Oh, look at me being all tired. <laughs> okay. Okay, well, then I guess I'm going to sleep for a little bit. Good God. That, I need that to was, lie down before I split my face open from yawning. That was a neat effect. <laughs> Alright. Well, I guess I have no choice but to lay down, do I? Well, this sucks because now I'm going to wake up in the middle of the night. But you do what you do. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to sleep the day away. 
get my energy back up. Let's just sleep for, let's get my energy up to uh, 87 here. We'll sleep for five hours. That way we'll still have some of the day to do something with. Just take a long nap. I guess maybe energy. Yeah, energy. I'll get up to... I thought it said 87%, but I'm skeptical now. I don't know how I'm going to get to 87 all of a sudden, but... Well, I don't know if I did. Let's see. It's raining pretty hard outside. Now I wonder if this room is still mine till tomorrow, or if now that I've slept in it, that's it. I don't know what time checkout is. Well, the game doesn't say I'm tired anymore. I'm still hung over from jail. Boy, it's raining really hard. That's a neat effect, huh? Looks like the ground's all muddy. This is neat. No, I don't. Why are you going that way, horse? Okay, so we're going to go up here to the alchemy bench. see what I need to make the lullaby potion. It'd be awesome if I had everything, but I don't think I do. We shall see soon enough. Okay. Alright, here we are. Hop off the horse. Go to the alchemy bench. Alright, read the book. And what we're interested in is lullaby. Herb Paris, thistle, and poppy. Okay, I need one poppy, one herb Paris, and one thistle. Well, man, where's all those weeds that I picked before for this guy? I, had a, I picked a ton of thistle, didn't I? Where the heck did it go? Oh, back out of this. Um, do I really not have thistle? I don't have any thistle, but I know where I could get some. I think I remember where to go. Let's see if there's more thistle over here. Oh, that's eye bright. Dandelion. Metal. I'm gonna find everything but thistle, aren't I? This is no, this is comfrey. Um, thistle, nice. I'm gonna pick a couple of these. Well, actually, just simply bending over, I end up picking a bunch of them. Three thistle. 19 poppy. The problem is, well, I have three uh, herb paris, so basically I'm going to have three chances to do this, and that's it. Because I don't know where to get more herb paris. I don't know what it looks like. I don't remember. So I have three herb paris, three thistle, and like 19 poppy. So let's see how this goes. Let's see if we can craft some lullaby potion for this guy. It ain't gonna be easy. Okay, here we go. All right. Okay, here we go. So, for lullaby, prepare oil, a handful of poppy, one of thistle, and one of herb paris. I'm not sure what prepare oil means drop the poppy in the cauldron and boil for one turn add the thistle and boil for one more turn leave to cool then add the herb paris and that's it <laughs> prepare okay it's prepared so um oil oil okay use the oil <laughs> okay, there's oil. All right. Then we drop the poppy in the cauldron and boil for one turn. So poppy, boil for one turn. Okay. Poppy. There's one. 
Drop it in the cauldron. Bellows. Sand glass. Sand glass. Okay. For one turn. Okay. All right. Now, uh, add the thistle and boil for one more turn. Okay. Add the thistle. Thistle. Add bellows. Sand glass. Bellows. Okay. Seems a little too long, but... Oh gosh, stop already. Oh gosh, that might have been too long. Now, I believe I just simply leave to cool and then add the herb Paris. Okay. How do I know when it's cool? I guess simply there's no fire. Herb Paris. Add that. Okay. And now, I put it in a file. Right. Use. And. <laughs> You've brewed, lo brewed lullaby potion. I did it. <laughs> All right, let's see if we can help this guy fall asleep. I don't remember which guy it was, though. Here he is, the insomniac, right here. Dude, I got something for you. Yeah, I've got something for you. I've got something for you. Really? Drink this and you'll fall straight to sleep. Oh, thank you. Good luck to you. Okay. All right, so we did that. Nice. Okay, cool, cool, cool. So, um... One lightly injured man couldn't get to sleep in the infirmary. After the potion I gave him, he should sleep like the dead. And I got some nutritious game meat for the infirmary. Now at least the sick will have some decent food. Okay. And um, now... I mean, it's still telling me I should have a look in the infirmary to see how they're doing. I don't know if I need to do that again. I can't talk to the wounded man. Can't talk to him. Can't talk to Philip. Or this guy. Talk to him again. You saved me. You've no idea what you've done for me. Oh God, thank you. I didn't do that much. You did more than anyone else here. We did a lot. I'm sorry, I've got no money to repay you. Hmm. But I can tell you a secret. How workers like me keep up back-breaking labor day after day. Reach new level of vitality. What did he tell us? Did he tell us something? What? What did he... I guess that's what gave me the new level of vitality, I guess. Hans, we can't talk to him. Can't talk to him. Can't talk to him. Can't talk to this guy. So there's nobody in here we could talk to. So. Can't talk to him. Can't talk to him. Well, um, so yeah, it doesn't look like there is anything else we could do. There's nothing else we could do for these people. Um, the only other thing is uh, to go and speak with uh, the custodian. But like I said, I don't want to do that when my, sp well, my speech is no longer impaired. Surprisingly. So I, I guess I could go talk to him. Um... I'd like to get my charisma up higher, though, but I'm not really sure how to do that. Um, let's put that back on. So I'm just going to take clothes off. I don't know if any of these 
This will no. Look at this. This necklace I thought was supposed to give me charisma, but it's not. Taking all this stuff off. Weird. So. Whoa. The van braces take my charisma down a level. Weird. Now the Waffen Rock isn't doing anything. Oh, okay, if I just click on it once. Okay, the gauntlets are a bad idea. Um. The Hallberg's a bad idea. Okay. And then my horse. I don't know if any of these will give me any charisma. This is a 6, 4, 4, 20. I'm already wearing one of those, though. Shoes is a 9. So let's take the shoes. Oh. 4, 9. I wonder if that's better than the one I'm currently wearing. And, um, the hat. So back over here. The hat, no, nope, doesn't do anything. I mean, unless they stack. Oh, I already had shoes. Noble's dark shoes versus Noble's shoes. Huh, these don't seem to do anything. This, these, they have a charisma of 19. So I don't know why they're not helping with my charisma. We'll move that back to the horse. This thing. This uh, hurts, so we won't put that on. Van braces have a charisma of eight. So yeah, I'm not sure why this isn't helping my charisma. I should probably put on some pants. Am I wearing pants? Let's put some pants on. Well, that's my charisma of nine outfit. I guess it's as good as I can get. Yeah. Wait a minute. Hold on. My horse. I have a potion. My charisma will be increased by five. Nighthawk. See better in the dark. Padfoot. Pickpocketing. Hmm. So I could take this potion and increase my charisma for, before I go and talk to him. That might help. Maybe we'll try that. So let's go um, pay this guy a visit. Custodian, we'll, we'll go and profusely apologize to him and uh, see if we can't um, get him to get some supplies for the uh, sick here. I guess he's in here. This is interesting. Nope, he's not. He's up here somewhere. Let me, let me. Oh, I dug on it. Can't wash myself there. There's no water in there. So where is this guy? Is he by this door here? Urban. What's up, dude? My respects to you, sir. Huh, and to you as well, sir. Who owns this house? Whose house is this? It's our local custodians. The most esteemed Sir Sebastian, Baron von Berg. Okay. Uh, what is a custodian, anyway? What does a custodian do, anyway? Well, he's meant to look after the local community and keep the peace. But? But in fact, he seems more interested in robbing everyone blind. Hmm. You don't think much of him, do you? You don't seem to think very much of him. Well, of course I do. A man with a nose so stuck up that it acts as a rain funnel. Can't be all bad. Okay. Much obliged. I'm much obliged. <laughs> don't mention it. Uh, you look bored, dude. You look bored. Beyond tears. How can you be bored here in Sasal? In such a holy place, filled with knowledge. Don't even talk to me about it. They won't let you touch the books. They don't want to talk to you. And when I wanted to look at the remains of St. Procopius, at least, they ran me off. Me. Like some kind of thief. What good is the whole blasted monastery if I can't even do that? 
I don't know, man. Uh, there's not much left of him. Well, they say there's not much left of poor Procropius. What's that got to do with anything? I'm not blaming you. It's just that only monks have access to the reliquary in the crypt. Folk were even taking relics away from St. Procopius' cave for protection before. Now no one's allowed in there. I know. But I'd never dream of doing that. I just wanted to touch them for luck. Well, maybe I could help you somehow. I don't know how, but maybe I can. Maybe I could help you. How? You're not planning some mischief, are you? Of course not. No, not at all. I was going to bring you something from the cave under the monastery where he spent his time. You can get in there, you could touch it for luck, and then I'd return it. Well now. Hmm. you do that for me? Of course. Then I'd be very grateful to you. Okay, great. Saintly remains quest. <laughs> you never know where you're going to get a quest. <laughs> get a piece of the remains of St. Procopius for Urban. Alright. Take care now. So that's an interesting quest we just picked up. Saintly remains. Urban would like to touch the remains of St. Procopius, but in local monastery, uh, monks do not allow him to do so. I offered to help him. Perhaps I could actually get some of the genuine relics. Or I could get a bone somewhere else. One bone is much like another. How would Urban know the difference? <laughs> get a piece of the remains of St. Procopius for Urban. If we show that on the map, well, apparently it's right here. We'll do that eventually. Can we go in? Okay, well, so far so good. Guard. Oh, crap. Well, unfortunately, I'm guessing that old, um, what's his face is retired for the evening, so we're not going to be able to talk to him tonight. Oh, geez, there he is. Oh. <laughs> Where the hell did you come from? Yeah, unfortunately, we're not going to be able to uh, talk to him unless he comes out. This is him. What's up? Good day. Yeah, good day. Uh, supplies? I'm helping at the infirmary now, and I came to our... Ah, and how is your hunker? Do you know her well? Y yes, I do. Good, good. Does she ever talk about me? Um, let's let's see if we could sweet talk this guy. Sometimes. A little. That's good. Excellent. Your hunker means a lot to me. I'm mainly here for his supplies and to talk about the state of the wounded from Scalitz. They need blankets, food. Well, that's not my problem. Let the infirmarius take care of it. His hands are tied. Until the abbot comes back, he can't get anything. And why should that interest me? Well... Maybe because of Johanka? Eh? Oh man, I forgot to take the potion. I'm such a doof. Doggone it. <sighs> I could have really used that. Oh well. Maybe because of Johanka. Hmm. What precisely are you getting at? Well, something uh, could happen to her too, someday. If any ill befalls my dear Johanka, she won't be left lying on some grubby floor. I will personally see to it she's taken care of. Doggone it. Fine, I'll pay you. Because I'll pay you. For supplies? But of course. That will be... Oh, come off it. You get your supplies from the monastery for free. No one will bat an eyelid if you ask for more. Blankets can get chewed up by mice. Food can go off. Oh, uh, ha, 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 ha. <laughs> he wants 150. We're going to offer 120. Since it's you. You're a right pinch purse. What? We weren't that far off. Jeez. What about this? Yes. That's These expensive. These things happen, certainly. And as long as the monastery needs my protection, they'll have to put up with it. Sure. Farewell. Doggone it. I can't believe I forgot to take the potion. Daggone it. I should rob this guy now. <laughs> it's weird how it's not saying that I'm in a private location. It's very strange. This stupid jerk. I'm tempted to lockpick, but I'm really worried that somebody would come up and see me. Still not private. 
Look at this. Oh, okay, that's nothing. I'm just seeing if there's something I could look at or even take. It's weird for a second there, it said lockpick, but I... Oh, this thing, yeah. Yeah, I can't read any of these things. Rob. Rob. Oh, wow, he has his own uh, bathroom. <laughs> With a door, even. Oh, look at this guy's fancy bed. Ah! Oh, he's coming back. Doggone it. I was going to totally rob this guy, too. I wonder if I have time. Do 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 do. Greetings. <laughs> I wonder if there's a chance he'll be like, I've been robbed. Where'd he go? What's he doing? Oh, he's sitting at his desk. Well, <laughs> just helped myself to a bunch of books. <laughs> Jerk. Anthology of Love Poems, a collection of love poems. Um, what else did we get? We got Old Father Check, in which the Czechs come home to... Uh, in which the Czechs come to their homeland. On St. Wenceslas, a book about Prince Wenceslas and how his brother had him killed. And The Legend of Melusine II, the second part of the Luxembourg legend about the fairy Melusine. I've either seen this book somewhere or I have it. Because I remember that. The, the first one, I mean. The Prince Electors on the Election of the Holy Roman Empire. Okay. You want to read some uh, love poems? You want to you read some love poems? Let's read some love poems. Gained a new level in uh, reading. Gentle Night. Gentle Night, why linger on? I yearn thus for my love so long without her words to still my breast. Who shall set my soul to rest? What are you looking at there, Henry? Uh, and now my heart in sorrow dwells from melancholic pining swells since I, alas, was forced to part from the mistress of my heart. Ah, Lord, let me not wait in vain. I yearn to see my love again. O oh, gentle sir, be of good cheer. I shall not cling to another, dear. Bravo. Bravo. Excellent. To love and be forlorn. To love and be forlorn is like night without a dawn. To be close with naught to say, like winter frost in May. To have lips and yet kiss not is like leaving grain to rot. To love without consummating is like unsown fields in the spring. I shall love you then, my dear, as long as you lie with me here. If you'll not give your all to me, no longer shall I bide with thee. There's something that I always wonder about. I may mean, not always, but occasionally wonder about this kind of thing. So I'm going to guess that, well, the, 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 the studio that wrote this game, I think they're in uh, Czech Republic, I think. They're not in the United States. So I wonder if like the original version of this game is in Czech. So I always wonder about poetry like this. Was this originally written in Czech? Is Czech even a language? I'm sorry. I don't know. <laughs> Please correct me. Anyway, was this originally written in a different language? And if it was, did it rhyme in that language? And if it did, I think it's pretty cool that they were able to translate it to English and make it rhyme in English as well. Does that make any sense? Ode to woman. Oh, this should be good. Woman is the root of sin, and yet of virtuous deeds again. In Eden it was woman's deed to pluck the apple from the tree. If you've no wealth to offer, you say, she will scorn you and turn away. But once you promise her treasure, she says she will love you forever. To murderous wrath she gives birth, leaving no peace on this earth. Wounds inflicted by swords cut less deep than woman's barbed wards. Ah, oh, I'm moved. I'm moved by that. I am. That was good stuff. I want to rob this guy some more. This stupid jerk. This guy's a jerk, man. I want more of his stuff. But, uh, I mean, I could... 
try to lockpick these things, but as soon as I did, he would probably stand up and come out here. Now, I could sit in here and like maybe w try to wait him out, but again, um, cobweb. Christ, a thief! Oh gosh! People, a thief! No, 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 no! What thief! are you talking about? No, 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 no! I'm not a thief! No, 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 no! Guard! No, 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 no! no. Surrender! Oh. Surrender! Oh, thief. Guard. oh boy, okay. Seen stealing. How did he see well, me? You won't forget this in a hurry. Because it'll take a <laughs> nice pile of coins to fix it. <laughs> oh jeez. I've been given a secret task. Let's see how dumb this guy is. Look, I'll tell you the truth, but you mustn't tell anyone. The Lord of Ratai sent me on a secret mission. <laughs> and to do it, I have to bend the law a little now and again. Understand? Oh, well, I, I, I thought that is, I, I had no idea. <laughs> if that's how it is, of course, you, you may go. You know what? I think that's fair because I think it's baloney that he somehow saw me doing that. I mean, I, I guess it's possible that maybe I was making too much noise and somehow he pff, heard me doing it. You jerk. You're coming right back up the steps. Doggone it. <laughs> so much for stealing more of his stuff. Uh, I, f I think it's fair that I was able to talk my way out of that. It was just as fair... Oh, he shut his damn door. <laughs> it was just as fair as, um, getting caught somehow. <laughs> Gosh, Henry, break your freaking ankle walking down stairs. <sighs> oh, well, anyway. Um, yeah. Well, uh, we got supplies, I think. Didn't we? Did he give us supplies? Did we get supplies? Now that I think about it, I, I don't know if he did give us supplies, did he? Well, it's not a uh, not on here anymore, so I guess that means um I guess that means we completed it. Yeah, and I guess that uh this quest won't show up there till I'm done. So, yeah, unfortunately I can't look at my done stuff here, but I don't see the quest to speak with him about supplies anymore, so I guess, um, I guess we're good. I guess. I don't know. Well, I tell you what. Let us, um, go back. Well, let's see here. Let's talk to Johanka. Real quick and see if she knows about the supplies. you Yohanka. There's Yohanka. Hey you. Uh yeah. about the situation Tell me here. More about the situation here. Uh I guess there's really nothing else. Alright, that's all I need to know. Um so I don't want to say there's nothing more I can do. Because I want to know if she is gonna know about the supplies so she could thank us, you know. That's why we did it, just to get thanked. So it is now eight o'clock and um, we do have a quest where we're supposed to get something from up there, right? We're supposed to get that thing for that charlatan dude. Turn off. Uh, this guy. Get a branch from the topping out and I'm pretty sure that we're looking right at it. That branch right there. Now, I don't know how we're going to get up there. Um, we can't get into this building right now. I don't know if like, there'll be like another time when we could get into it. Or if somehow we could walk up this scaffolding. Or climb it even. Okay, we're climbing. Well, it's not saying anything about me being in a place I shouldn't be. Although I keep hearing stuff. I don't know if it's just the sound of me climbing up here or if there are other people up here. <laughs> I like that I robbed that guy, though. <laughs> I don't like him. It's 
Justified. He's a jerk, so he deserves to be robbed. Steal his collection of love poems. Spare Yohanka. Because you know he was going to read them to her. Especially that last one. Still have a ways to go. But this is nice that this is here. We can climb up. Okay, we're getting there. Hopefully nobody will see us do this. Boy, I tell you what though, when they think, when they catch you stealing, they are on you like that. Super quick, man. And do not waste any time. Okay, well, I believe this is um, what we came here for. Am I supposed to like climb over this and walk out on that um, branch? Is that what I'm supposed to do? Oh man, I don't know. Can I shoot it with a bow and maybe knock a branch off of it? Do you think I could do that? <laughs> I did not think that would work. <laughs> That's so awesome. I'm so glad I didn't try to climb out there. I would have fallen to my death, no doubt. Awesome. Let's get down there and get our branch, man. <laughs> Hopefully nobody else will pick it up or notice that that happened. <laughs> it was so great. I'm getting dizzy. Oh, I'm so excited. I can't wait to get down all these ladders. I don't dare jump down. Henry will definitely break his ankles. He breaks his ankles walking down stairs. You can see that my health is a little low. Oh, crap. Oh, I grabbed onto that ladder as I was falling. But yeah, you can see I, help, I hurt myself a little bit walking downstairs in the custodian's place. Where's the last ladder? Getting dark quick. Better get down here. Oh, no. Not the last ladder. One more. Okay. Let's get this thing. Oh, there's my arrow. It's broken though. Here's the branch. Topping out. <laughs> got it, man. <laughs> I freaking got it, man. <laughs> oh my gosh. So awesome. It is nighttime, so let's hop on pebbles here. Good night, Yohanka. And um, we are going to uh, go back to the inn. Boy, it is dark. Oh, that's not the way I wanted to go, is it? Or is it? I don't know, man. This way, I think. I, don't know. I really don't know. I think I'm going the wrong way. Okay. I think I go by this building here. I guess this is the way I go. I can't believe how quickly, how dark it got so quickly. Yeah, hopefully there's nobody walking, because if there is, we're going to run over them. Alright, here's our buddies. What's up, y'all? Sorry, uh, there's only one bed in my room. Okay, let's see if we still have this room. If not, I'll buy it again. Big deal. Well, it looks like I still have it. It's not showing up as, um... Private. Cool, man. Put our torch away. Crawl into our bed. And sleep. And that'll be the end of this episode. Yeah, pretty awesome, huh? <laughs> I had a lot of fun in this episode. I hope you did too. If you did, 
Why don't you let me know? Leave me a like or a comment. I sure would appreciate that. Thanks to everybody who takes the time to do that. It really makes me uh, happy to see your comments and your likes. So thank you for doing that. Uh, if you're not a subscriber, why not subscribe? That way you'll be notified whenever I post a video. Thanks for watching. Hope to see you guys again in the next episode.